This is Shannon McGee with Network in Action Music City Referral Network. And today I have with me Kelly Eichem with the ERA Group. Welcome, Kelly. Hi, Shannon. And hi, everybody. Great to be here. Great to have you with me today. So I'm really interested. Um, you're also a franchise owner, so like myself. You know, what What made you decide to, to buy a franchise and jump in with the ERA Group? Yeah, Shannon. Well, I have been doing business and technology consulting for 28 years, and I love consulting because I love helping businesses succeed and grow and you know be successful and meet their goals. So um, ERA was a really good transition for me because it's still on the consulting side. And I still get to work with all different industries and all different size businesses. Um, but the franchise allows me to be my own business owner as well. And so it's great. And it's an amazing network of people. I love that was the biggest thing that drew me to this group was just the people, the quality and the caliber of people and how just smart and amazing they are. So it's awesome. And I love it. I love that. I love, we have a lot in common. I love your passion for helping growing businesses. I love your passion for the network and the connections right? And you're like me, this, this franchise gave me this opportunity to do what I do, you know, with a, in a, in a fabulous way. You know, I love, um, you know, that you said you work with any industry. So, you know, are there, there's some maybe that you've had, you know, exceptional success in, or maybe there's just a couple of maybe surprising stories. I think I have a feeling that, your services produce some surprising results for some of your, some of your clients. Yeah, they definitely do. I mean, we do work across industries, but I will say we do a lot of work with manufacturing companies. And part of that is because we look at over 45 cost categories and manufacturing companies just have a lot of different things going on, right? With their facility and the facility management. And a lot of times there's, you know, machinery and there's employees and uniforms and waste and logistics and distribution. I mean, there's just so much going on there. Um, but we also do a lot of work in the healthcare space, education, nonprofits, and then just, you know, general businesses. Because we look at the whole spend of companies, um, you know, we can we can help out in any industry, right? Because they're all different. We might do, you know, six cost categories for one company and, you know, six different ones for a different company. Um, and even within manufacturing, they'll be different because everybody every company is unique, right? In what they're doing. And so it, it is surprising. And I love it because I get surprised sometimes where we're able to find savings. And that's why our um, analytics tool that we have is so great because every business is different. So we're looking at the actual spends of the company and identifying based on our benchmark data where there's opportunity for improvement. So it's really fun and exciting and I love it. <laughs> that's awesome. So so is there a limit to size? Like do small companies, can they take advantage of it as well? Can are enterprise companies, are they too big? I mean, a lot of times companies work with a cer certain segment or size company. It sounds like you can work with anyone. We really can. I will say that our sweet spot is between 10 million and 250 million in revenue, but we do have companies that are smaller and companies that are larger. It's just because we're looking at the whole spend, um, you know, larger companies over 250 million, a lot of times we'll have more people on staff, right, that can look at the different cost areas. And when they're smaller than 10 million, a lot of times, you know, there's just not as much in there and they don't necessarily need the type of help, right, and the breadth of information that we have. Although I will say we do have for smaller companies, um, we have a staples program that is wonderful that allows them to save between 30 and 60 percent on their office purchases. And so since we're a bigger company and we're bringing a lot of different clients to our support suppliers, then they allow us to, you know, bring in smaller companies and they get the benefits like they were a larger company. So that's another thing that's really exciting for us. That's awesome. You know, I love the idea that maybe it's just a place to start for a small company, um, but then also, you know, better understanding, you know, that size and what you bring to the table. It's so, it's so interesting. It, it I just feel like your service is so important to so many. And it sounds, it sounds risk-free, right? You do an assessment with everybody. And so, so you can do assessment and then, and then what, like you kind of tell them that you see some opportunities and then they just decide to move forward or not. It, I mean, that seems like a no brainer. 
Yeah. And you know, how we do it is that our business model is amazing because it's, it's risk-free for the clients. Like we're taking on all the upfront risk because we're doing our, you know, analysis for free. And the reason we can do that is because 92% of the time we're finding between 10 and 30% savings in one or more cost areas. Right. And so we're, we're just, allowing our clients to take advantage of the assessment piece so that we can just see, you know, where they're doing well and where there might be opportunities for improvement. And so once we identify areas for improvement, uh, we just bring those to the table and our process is very transparent. So we're bringing it to the table and saying, these are the areas we see opportunity. Um, And a lot, you know, sometimes the clients do have staff to take care of that, but right now the labor market is so tight and people are just wearing so many hats that, you know, they will hire us on to go ahead and go through the whole process with them. And then at the end, we stay with our clients for 24 months after we implement the the new contracts, because a lot of times when the contracts are signed, what happens? They go into the file cabinet and nobody ever pays any attention to them. (laughs) And so our maintenance program is that we're staying on and we're keeping an eye on things because more than 60% of the time invoices are incorrect and nobody is looking at them. They're just getting paid through the accounting department. And there's like just fees that slip in there that aren't supposed to be in there that weren't in your contract. Um, And the other advantage of us when we stay on for the 24 months is that we do knowledge transfer. So we're giving our clients information and training them basically on how to be better negotiators moving forward. And so there's a lot of things that go along with that um, on the maintenance side that is just a real big advantage for our clients. You know, Kelly, it's pretty amazing. Like it, you just really feel like a no brainer partner for any business. It's just, you know, you're in there, as you said, you're passionate about helping and, and you have a means to, to help at no risk to them. It, it just seems like, it seems like a great fit for a lot. So, so if someone wanted to get a hold of you, what's the best way to reach you? Yeah, so they can give me a call on my cell phone or text me. My number is 708-908-0535. Or they can email me at my email address, which is uh, K-E-I-K-U-M at expensereduction.com. That's wonderful. Well, Kelly, thanks for joining me today. I love learning more about what you do and looking forward to hearing more great things that you're doing for your clients. Awesome. It's great to talk to you today, Shannon.